Lost Book of Nostradamus, Part One: Replacement, the Keys of Heaven, Symbolic, Unreal. Nostradamus informs: The keys of the kingdom of heaven already do not belong to the papacy. From the above, they are replaced by the real keys and are given to the Russian scientists. In 1994, in Rome, was found a very old book with over 70 watercolor drawings. It is believed that this is a lost book of one of the most famous predictors and astrologers, Nostradamus. The debate about the authorship of the book continues. However, even a cursory glance was enough to understand: these are drawings, pictograms, information in which is presented in symbols of consciousness. We were given from the above. Two keys to decode the symbolism of consciousness. So we read these drawings, pictograms. Decoding showed that these pictures convey a brand new, life important for humanity information about the events of the global cataclysm's beginning. The information transmitted through pictures not only coincided with given to us from the above about these events, but it more focused and emphasized the main idea. On this basis, we consider no matter who fulfilled these drawings, Nostradamus or any other, certainly a great predictor of the past. We will continue to call them pictures of Nostradamus and consider their content. We have decoded almost all the pictures. One of the main messages of Nostradamus, which convey many of the pictures, informs that on the eve of the beginning of global cataclysms. Humanity from the above will be given detailed information for the transition to the highest level of the material world, that is, the kingdom of heaven. Moreover, the instructions will be given in written form. However, they will be presented in not understandable to mankind symbolism of consciousness. Therefore, from the above, will also be given the two keys for their reading. Nostradamus informs that these keys to the symbolism of consciousness for reading the instructions will be given from the above to the woman, and indicates in several pictures her date of birth, the year of the ox, and the sign of Libra. In all pictures on the head of this woman, Nostradamus showed the papal tiara. It is known that the tiara and the keys of heaven are the symbols of papal authority. So the tiara on the head of the woman is arrow pointer, that it is she was given the keys for reading the instructions for the transition of humanity to the new cycle of life. Nostradamus informs that the woman with the keys will appear simultaneously with the beginning of global cataclysms. To transmit this information, Nostradamus depicts the body of the woman in tiara, grown together with a body of a snake, the symbol of cataclysms. As predicted by Nostradamus, the two keys to the symbolism of consciousness for reading the instructions were given from the above to the woman, Russian scientist Victoria Popova. Moreover, true was specified by Nostradamus the date of birth of that woman. Victoria Popova was born in a year of the ox under the sign of Libra. Victoria Popova is decoding pictograms presented by the symbols of consciousness, together with her sister, Lydia Andrianova. These two Russian women scientists, Victoria Popova and Lydia Andrianova, decoded many hundreds of pictograms presented by symbols of consciousness, and composed the Dictionary of Symbols of Consciousness for over 300 symbols. Thus, Nostradamus informed that before the start of global cataclysms from the above, will be replaced the keys of heaven. Symbolic keys belonging to the papacy from the above will be replaced by the real keys that will allow to lead given from the above the instructions for the transition of humanity to the highest level of the material world, that is, the kingdom of heaven. The information about already made replacement of the keys is extremely important. First of all, it means that humanity is on the eve of global cataclysms beginning. It is therefore necessary to know in advance what has to do each of us in accordance with the instructions for the transition, which will be claimed immediately after the first preliminary cataclysm. This cataclysm will be the weakest of the three preliminary cataclysms. However, it will be unprecedented for humanity's strength. 
He will bring great human losses and destroy huge territories. Cataclysm will destroy the communication between countries and people, and it will take time to restore it. So, why from the above were replaced the keys of the Kingdom of Heaven that were originally handed to the Apostle Peter, who is the first Pope? For two millennia, the two keys of heaven belonged to the papacy. These keys constantly reminded mankind that in case of mortal danger, it can be saved and continue life in the kingdom of heaven. This was done in order that humanity can quietly live on the planet, improving consciousness and not worry about its fate. That is why the kings of heaven is the main symbol and emblem of Vatican City and are depicted on the flag and its coat of arms on the arms of all the popes. Their image can be seen in all the most unexpected places, even on the door. The keys is the business card of Vatican City. Today, before the start of global cataclysms, the time has come when mankind really needs to use the keys of heaven to save life, because starting global cataclysms of the planet's destruction really pose a mortal danger. Therefore, for salvation from certain death, Mankind, completely tied to the planet that has to be destroyed, from the above were given the detailed instructions that point the only way to continue living. However, the instructions are written by not understandable for humanity symbol of consciousness. Therefore, for reading the instructions from the above were given also the two keys. The keys to the symbolism of consciousness are shown in many pictures of Nostradamus. Only they allow reading the instructions for humanity. Transition to the highest level of the material world. So, what represent these two keys to the symbolism of consciousness by which are written the instructions for the transition? The first key is a representation of a human being on the information level of the universe, that is, in the world where our consciousness works. This is individual information cell of each of us, that has an image of a circle with a small dot in the center which represents a brain area of a human. As a human being this information cell has also an area of a body and a border which separates one cell from another. Digital analog of the cell is a trident which informs about the fourth level of individual consciousness of a human being. The image of individual cell represents the square in front of the Cathedral of St. Peter. However, the shape of the square informs also about the unification of consciousness and the expansion of the brain area as a result of this process. The second key to the symbolism of consciousness for reading the instructions reveals the law of the action of the united consciousness. This is the main law for the transition to the safe highest level of the material world. This key informs that under association of consciousness of two or more people, a brain area in each cell shifts from the center of it to its border for information exchange. In this case, a brain area of the cell of the united consciousness expands. The law of the united consciousness action informs that as a result of unification of consciousness with a common goal in the information world happen rearrangements in accordance with the intended purpose. As a result of these rearrangements in the material world arises an action that causes phenomena of consciousness such as levitation, clairvoyance, telekinesis, intuition, dowsing and others. Thus the keys of heaven which papacy had for nearly two millennia were only symbolic. On the eve of the beginning of global cataclysms, these symbolic keys of heaven from the above were replaced by the real and given to the Russian scientists. Humanity definitely has to be informed about the made from above the replacement of the keys. First of all, it means that we are on the eve of the beginning of global cataclysms of the planet's destruction. However, humanity firmly has to know that now all of us have the real keys of heaven for salvation. These two keys allow reading the instructions given from the above to explain in detail how to get into this kingdom of heaven, how to make the transition there. So new real keys given from the above for reading the instructions for the transition already do not belong to the papacy. They belong to the Russian scientists. 
These new keys really open to humanity the only way for continuation of life as it was promised 2,000 years ago. More information is presented on our website www.ourtransition.info